Hey y'all, it is Monday. Hope you all had a good Mother's Day. Our friend Josh showed up <laughs> and the garden is getting tilled. <laughs> yeah, we thought his tractor was bigger, but it's, it's Mark calls it a glorified uh, lawnmower and he was looking at that getting the Kubota version of that. Um, now I've seen it, I want it. <laughs> but he's just gone over once with it and he's starting on the smaller patch. Uh, the garlic, we's doing good. I weeded it out. So, yup, it's going good. We're supposed to get more rain tonight. So, the potatoes are getting big. Colorado's really doubled in size. Sweet potatoes haven't grown much since last week. So, but that's how the outside's looking. This one around. I'm starting on the patch that, that's going to be new this year where we're putting the corn. So, that's what I'll be doing all this week. <laughs> Getting the rows ready. All right, let's go inside real quick. Add it, and I've got to do it kind of quick, 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 quick because I don't want Jake to get out. All right, so we got tons and tons of rain and some of the plants did not do too well. I guess they were too young still, but our habanero crapped out on us, but we uh, replant we had backup of it. So we replanted in here because the rest that we got are gonna run out into the outside garden. So potatoes have been strong. <laughs> My two oldest were over yesterday for Mother's Day and helped Mark get those all strung up. So, and this inside is doing good. All my wildflowers and stuff are starting to come up really good. So, the watermelon is starting to climb. So, hopefully in a few weeks they'll be even all over that. So, let me turn back around and try not to get in the sun. Do, do, do. But what suffered the most really was our white tomatoes and black crims. They just, it was just so much rain. We got probably eight, nine inches of rain in the matter of two and a half, three days. As you can see, the whites are struggling a bit. So, and they've had the last two days to dry out. And some of the Amish also is struggling. And the black cream, they look better than the whites do right now. But it was just so much rain. The Cherokees, cherries have got flowers on them. They're happy. They could care less. They loved all the rain. So, the herbs really like the rain too. <laughs> I'm already going to have to start harvesting some of my unique basils. Because I don't want to oh, get that flower off. Because they, I don't want them getting so big while they're in this uh raised bed my sweet marigem is starting to come up i i wanted it to just kind of creep all around the bottom of the that because everything else in here grows tall and that's just the creeping like with the thyme and stuff so but yeah some of the flowers really liked all the rain and some did not like mark's flames eloses or something whatever they're called so just a quick video to show how everything is going. I took the uh, sunflower out of my chives and planted it out front, so. But yeah, all the herbs, <laughs> I, I, I gotta do some harvesting already and get it drying. Because Russian, I don't want it, it's ready to go. It's ready to say, okay, you can take me. The oregano is, the Italian's really perked up my new one in the middle there is not so much so the blackberries you can see our berries yay we got about 50 on there so hopefully we'll get to eat them before the birds do <laughs> but like i said just a quick video how everything is it's just so much rain has it's just odd if it rained just a little at night, that'd be fine. You know, split it up. <laughs> but eight inches in 72 hours is a little bit much. So the zucchini liked it. The cucumbers over here liked it. 
Uh, we're getting a lot of male flowers, but I haven't seen any female flowers yet. It was, it had probably about 20 male flowers in the last few days. So, but it's still early. So hopefully in a couple weeks, <laughs> Mark, we get some cucumbers growing. But I hope everybody had a good weekend and stay safe out there. I know people, friends, that family that are out in the Midwest. You guys got some nasty storms coming and I worry about my youngest who's on tour right now. I can't remember the name of the band he's on tour with, but they're going into Texas and all that area. So everybody be safe and let me know how your all garden's going. I will see y'all next week. Bye.